Okay, so first of its kind, the Primal Raminator. The solid axle, ready to run monster truck, two stroke reed valve, 49cc gas mini motorcycle engine. A centrifugal, a centrifu centrifugal, <laughs> how do you say that? Raminator. 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 Everyone's going to be now to giving me a pronunciation in the comment section right Centrifical. now. Centrifugal. Cent cent centrifugal. <laughs> Look at the size of your box, dude. This is impressive. You can hide at least a body and a half in there. I think there may be in there. Big shout out to RC Tanks and Trucks, hey? What's up, boys? There, there's, here, let me. What's up, boys? We got a Raminator! <laughs> this was stuck at customs for two weeks. I felt like I was at the prom date and everyone was f***ing my date. <laughs> oh, God. What? <laughs> That's true. Look at this. I, I felt the same way and it's not even mine. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's been out running this, having a great time, and we finally get to see it and finally. have it released from customs. Why is this box open? Oh, because I wanted to have a look inside and see. I haven't seen yet. You want here? You go ahead. Open this up. Tell me what you see in there. I see that the box is forty-four pounds. It does. I carried it. Forty in here. forty-four pounds. Just oh, look. That's just good. this. I know. I was fooled by it as well. Look oh at that. Oh my God! The videos do not do that. Do not. There's no. There's no justice made on that. Kind that, of that is a Texas donut, that, man. That is. I got goosebumps. I'm not even kidding. Yeah. Goosebumps. So you're telling me that just in the box oh, are tires? For reals, man. <laughs> you the got chills? <laughs> Been a long time since the fifth scale boss had chills from an RC, bro. Are you kidding? Like, I mean, I saw that. Wow. Like, just gave them a shout out there. But that's. Yeah. That's another level. That is that is as large as the fifth uh, scale loader that I had. That is in charge. Yeah. Same tire Even size. In charge. Wow. Nice metal hex inside there. Good, so we don't have to worry about rounding it out. Wowzers. Shout out to Dan and Irene from Primal RC for designing such an amazing vehicle the world has never seen. That's insane, man. Rip that off there. Nice job, man. So nice, soft rubber compound. A lot of people don't even know what the frick we're talking about because this no. is so new on the market, hey? If you guys haven't gone to PrimalRC.com yet, then go down there now. I'll leave a link in the description box down below. We have not seen this except for on video so far, although we've been knowing about this since it's been getting developed. Yeah. Yeah? Let's keep wow. going. Let's get the rest that of this out here. The rear axle and the front axle is about as large a box as a normal RC would come in. Just don't want to oh scrape it. yeah. This is the goodness we've wow. been waiting for. I love, I've been waiting to see the brushed aluminum axle up front. Look at that, and shocks. Please. Look at the size of the shock, man. I thought the ones on the Vecta 5 were huge. That's, That's next level. Two yep. springs. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a forearm, man. Winks, it is. Yeah, <laughs> and how tall are you? I'm 6'1". Exactly. Let's the see it. Box. Yeah. Decals on either side. Oh. Dude. Size, it is impossible to show. Size matters. Dude, <laughs> it's enormous! It's massive. <laughs> Cut this one? Yeah, let's do it. It's got staples in it, dude. Yeah. We're going deep. Going deep. <laughs> Holy. Show you my Holy. Look at this, man. Ah, uh, there is the other two tires underneath it there. So two tires and the axles in one box, and then the body and two tires in the other. Shall we? Oh, that's pretty heavy too. Wow. Yeah, wow indeed. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Large and in charge, even the gas tank. Wow. Where's some zip tie cutters, some wire cutters. This thing is insane. All the reports. I know you guys are probably out looking at videos right now of this machine. 
because my small screen on your phone is not going to capture <laughs> the yeah. size of this monster. Yeah, I, I watched a couple videos and I was not expecting this still. It's yeah. next level. I love that there's a driver on the inside. First thing I want to do is hook up an FPV and servo to it. Look at the size of these bad boys here. The links, yeah, everything about it. Ever since I saw the, uh, here, the unveiling video. Right here. Yeah, right there. Yeah. Dude. Thud. Thud. <laughs> Holy cow. Yeah, you handle that, Everett. Oh, it takes yeah. a full arm to grab it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, look at the carbs upside down over back here. That's interesting. Oh, yeah. It's got an exhaust pipe already on it, too. Yeah, this thing, I can't believe it's brushed aluminum back there. <laughs> yeah, you keep you keep it up, buddy. <laughs> I just keep my hands off of it. <laughs> you know, you know when you gotta put the axles on it right now, right? Yeah, we gotta build it right now. Thump. Hope you don't mind, you've had it 10 seconds and I'm just like going at it. Please do, man. I mean, you did say it was like your prom date. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I should be involved and not just watching all of a sudden. <laughs> Give me the cutters. <laughs> Give me the cutters. <laughs> okay, so back. the sway bars are insanely huge. Yeah, everything about it is a monster, hey? What do you think, the battery box? Oh, this is probably battery here. Yeah, Must be receiver it, box. Yeah, and cut off. Having a huge engine in here, which people I see are debating about how slow it is, right? Have you read that as well or seen I, that? I've witnessed video Come on, let's be straightforward. Proof. People are saying it's slow as shit yeah, for a truck this fairly, big. Uh, yeah, it's goddamn massive. <laughs> it's massive. It's massive. Being 49cc, uh, let me, t I'll tell you, one of the things I know is liability, man. These guys were wanting to put out a massive platform. If there are people that want to put bigger engines into this, uh, that's definitely uh, available. I know that there are two companies making gas engines for it right now. Uh, and if, you know, the people that can drop 3,000 US on a truck like this aren't going to really complain too bad if they want a faster engine, you know? what I mean well, my thoughts on it are too there's a couple reasons that is definitely one of them but the other's got to be cost well yeah yeah I mean now you're talking to out a if the company is out a modded engine it's just driving the price up heavily so they got to make an entrance point somewhere there we go right there what dude I want to see I know you do <laughs> I know I know hold on let me cut this second oh, drive front. shaft out yeah. yeah give it a good pull yeah <laughs> And then I'll leave the rest What's on that? there. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. The tranny in that sucker is insane. Yeah, that is insane. There you go, it's beautiful. <laughs> That's crazy, man. That's perspective for you. That's crazy. Let's get in there and have a look at this. Look at the size of those bolts are the size of my pinky finger. Amazing, man. Roll it around, let's see it. All brushed. It's, again, one of those RCs I don't really want to run against any rocks because it's too pretty right out of the box. That's a you solid, know what's going over that's a solid like, piece. Uh, you know what's going over the bump out there in the, the middle, right? Oh yeah, right. uh, it's going over <laughs> everything. <laughs> this is uh, not your kid's toy. Ain't picking this up at Walmart right now. Holy cow. Look at that sucker. Wow. Dual that. steering servos Look on at there. The servo saver. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> it's like, it's huge. <laughs> this is a work of art. Wow. Good design, Dan. Good job, man. It's gorgeous. Ooh, it's like butter. Try it. Oh, that is tight. Look and look at the look at that man. Look how thick they are. That's definitely what she said. Okay, so first shock going on and second shock in the back. Getting ready to hook up the four link. Use plug battery, huh? Woo! 
We went in here. Look at this beautiful engine. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, they wanted to put out a great platform. <laughs> they didn't want the liability of making it go a billion miles an hour. That's crazy. Yeah, it's amazing. Here's the pull start right here. Yeah, we are like deep into surgery right now, not doing piece by piece with you guys, just kind of getting you up to date because we're also figuring it out, watching the movies on the Primal RC YouTube channel on how to assemble this behemoth. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good way to say it, eh? Yeah. There is hey, a lot. Good progress quickly, a lot going on. Look at the dual servos, the way they move back and forth. Yeah, so these servos are probably going to plug into here. Okay, so we've already done it on the front, but what are you unbagging right now? The uh, brake disc and caliper. So this has functioning brake discs. Yeah, cable functioning brake discs. Yeah. yeah, which isn't new to monster trucks, that's for oh. sure. But it's pretty awesome. It is, it's huge. <laughs> <laughs> the back one going on a lot quicker than the front. What you do to one side, you do to the other. Yes, Everett? Agreed. Now, can you please tell me, sir? 12. Why people do not understand what an engine break-in is. Why, what is it? It's to seat the piston ring. Right, and yeah. so when you break in an engine, yeah. what are you supposed to do with a gas engine? What's the proper break-in procedure? Well, there's different methods, but you know, the main method is to beat the living shit out of it. Right, and so. Just run it. I would say <laughs> that that is not it at all. In fact, no, you need to run it rich. You need to bog it down a little bit, give it lots of lubrication, and run it, yes? Depending on the engine, for sure. This engine, though, run it like you stole it, for sure. I feel like that was bad advice. You've been saying otherwise, like on your other monster truck on the low C5 with yeah. the monster wheels. Yeah. You had a new engine. Every single fifth scale engine we've ever done, you wanted to have it slobbery and slow. On my modded engines, for sure, yeah. Yeah, and? This one's a different type, type of engine. This one isn't going to rev the same as those other ones. You know, you're not getting to 22, 24,000 RPMs with this engine. This one's much lower so to seat the ring on this one to heat it up you're really just going to want to bag on it bum, 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 bum. dude i've never noticed how small your hands were until just now man you know it's crazy when you're holding 10 scale tires how big they can make your hands look <laughs> <laughs> yeah let's start this big fella up that's right where's the radio here they're going to want they're going to want a comparison there's a 10 scale trail truck right there <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. See? X Max. Unbelievable. Yeah. It barely, and this is heavy, it's full of muddy water in the tires. It barely moved the suspension. <laughs> it's amazing. Unbelievable. Got it? Yeah. Well, let's fire it up, man. Fire it up. Uh, radio on. Uh, radio on. On. Three, two, one. Oh, you know what? On off switch. That's helpful. In channel three, everything's armed. Good. Oh. Right out of the gate. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what the hell is that? Dude. That. Oh, yeah. We gotta drive it! We need to drive it! So for those that are wondering about runaways, there is a channel 3 right here on the um, on the handle where I can kill that engine. If I lose signal, it automatically kills it as well. Everett, I might have a new favorite, man. Dude, it is cooler than I would have thought. The sound of it. Sounds mean. It does, man. Here, why don't you give her a rip around? I'll work the camera a bit. Now you can hear it's boggy. I do have different gear ratios here. First rip, though. 
so many people right now in the comment section. Oh, I don't like it. It's too slow. I'm going to save my money. What a platform! There are new engines being built for this right now. Like another RC, like it feels like it's going up and over that hill. But there it didn't even just like what was there? Was there a no? Bump? It's like, like I, I... crawler gearing right now. Yeah, yeah, it's like crawler gearing for sure. But it's like did I? Is there a bump there? <laughs> well, yeah, you try that. it's effortless up that bump there. Give that there. a shot. <laughs> <laughs> it's so heavy. Oh, the brakes are good. Eighty pounds. Eighty pounds. Eighty pounds, and those tires are huge. Imagine the force those axles are under. Oh man, those. it's pretty awesome. In person, I know video doesn't do it justice. No. We've been watching videos and it doesn't do it justice. No, but the power it's of it is impressive. Like it's not, <laughs> like yeah, it's not doing 100 miles per hour, but it, the power of it is impressive. Anybody that wants to say it's too slow, come stand in front of it. I'll hit you <laughs> at full blast. You can tell me how slow it feels in the shin. <laughs> how slow it feels in the shin. <laughs> But we are filming into the sun. We need two of these. We do need two of these. We have a monster jam. Oh, it's awesome. Yeah. I can see it now. New bodies, rear wheel steering kit. Faster engine, monster jams. Oh, I should have done it. <laughs> Dude, this thing's pretty tough. It just sounds so much better than the low C5, man. It's so much throatier. It is throaty, that's for sure. Yeah. Uh -oh. oh! <laughs> the first one! Yeah, I'm glad it wasn't mine. <laughs> Did you hear that laugh? <laughs> Oh man, I almost fell. Are you kidding me? monster truck cars <laughs> hey what are your thoughts <laughs>